New at 5, this restaurant in the Shoals is shut down while police investigate a possible sexual assault. Police found a 19-year-old woman unresponsive in the 72 Roadhouse restaurant on Highway 72 in Rogersville. Police did arrest David Calvert, the manager of the restaurant, for contributing to the delinquency of a minor. Two other employees were also arrested on outstanding warrants. Thanks for joining us. I'm Dan Schaefer. And I'm Demetria McClinton. Way 31's Brecken Terry shows us who told police what was happening. Brecken. I'm at the 72 Roadhouse restaurant that is still a crime scene. You can see tape up around this building, and police tell us they have padlocked this place while they continue to investigate what happened to this 19 year old victim. Rogersville police told Way 31 they got a 911 call from the victim's friend saying she was being forced into sexual activities or being sexually assaulted. Police showed up to do a welfare check on the victim, who also works at the 72 restaurant and found her unresponsive and barely breathing. The victim was rushed to Eliza Coffey Memorial Hospital where doctors and nurses tested to see if she was raped. Investigators said they're waiting on results of the test before arresting anyone for assault. They're also looking to see if she was drugged. Rogersville police did tell us when they showed up, the restaurant's manager, who was in the process of buying the restaurant, was drunk. Police also arrested Ashlyn Fulgham, the bartender at the restaurant, on outstanding traffic warrants. The cook, Jerry Griffin, was arrested for drug warrants, and Rogersville police also found pot and pills on him. Rogersville police tell me city council members plan on having an emergency meeting to discuss possibly taking away this restaurant's liquor license. The victim has been released from the hospital. In Rogersville, Breck and Terry, Way 31 News. Thanks, Brecken. According to the Rape, Abuse and Incest National Network, there are nearly 322,000 rape and sexual assaults every year. Only a third of those are reported to law enforcement. In 80% of these cases, the victims knew or were related to the offender. And in Alabama, almost 2,000 rapes were reported, 79% of those committed by someone the victims knew. To follow this developing story on the details and those details, just head to our website, waytv.com.